brothers, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm in the middle. I have our black male code to a certain extent. I'm a black male, but I'm just one of those few of us that actually loves the women that births us. And I would never, ever. I've been married to a Mexican woman. There's some of us that are in the middle. It's not black and white young brothers. I get it. It's, it you know, we older generation, we don't understand where you guys came from. Outwardly, just totally downgrading us like this. But that's all right. That's a different story. This is really for the young black brothers. I really do want to see you guys travel because we don't as black people. And it's so beautiful that young black men are getting out to go see the world. But you're bringing back an untruth. It is not safe for us like that. Still travel. Yeah. Get you a fine Latina. But do it right, young black men. Think about how it is in this country right now for you. It is not better. Now, I'm not saying don't go and I'm not saying don't experience life, but especially Colombia. I teach Hispanic civilization and culture. Black men, be in the middle, travel the world, be you, but stop tearing down our mother and sisters. Tell them the truth. It's not safe like that. We are seen as Vicks. Now it might not be right, but it's the truth. We are the biggest Vicks. Why? Because all you want is some fucking pussy. All you want is some goddamn Latina pussy. That's all you show. Just like here. Just like here. Now that doesn't mean you can't find a woman over there that loves you. Of course you will. They all want a damn passport. I got fucking played. And speak the language fluently. That's how big the game is. Be careful, young black men. This is not just as easy as, oh, they just want you. Oh, yeah, they, they, yeah, yeah you're going to get some pussy because that's the image that we portray. That's the image we portray. We're going to get some pussy and that's it. You're going to spend your money and you're going to marry them and you're going to get them out of poverty. The same thing you can do here for your own black people. Same thing you could do. Period. And I'm going to stop right there because you know what? This is not to go down on my black brothers. I'm going to be honest with you because I'm a black man from Chicago. And even though I'm one of the righteous ones, I'm still a black man and I cannot unmarry myself from the ridiculousness that we're showing to the world the last 15 years. I still love you because I'm you. I'm just not going to do what you do. There's some of us in the middle. And you know what? I love my sisters. I love my mother, her nappy hair, her big lips, because it's mine. Stop tearing down our fucking people. You don't understand. I'm a high school teacher. Everybody in the world sees us as fucking buffoons. Stop. Yeah, they beautiful over in, over in, over in Colombia, but it's some ugly motherfuckers too, and you know it. <laughs> You know it. Be in the middle. Travel the world. Do it, please. Open your mind, brother. Please. But stop telling everybody that everything is better over there. They hate your ass just like they hate you over here. I'm not gay no more. I am delivered. I don't like men no more. I said I like women. Women, 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 women. <laughs> I said, women, I'm not gay. I would not date a man. I would not carry a purse. I would not put on makeup. I will, I will love a woman.